The Vehicle Design Summit uh, consists of students from 13 countries, about 20 universities. We had four vehicle teams that each designed and built from scratch a complete vehicle that carried either one or two passengers and would really make a positive impact on the issue of commuter commuter travel. We're doing a ground up reanalysis of everything you find in a car. We're trying to build a two-seater uh, commuter car. I, I really enjoyed designing things and this thing this uh, this event is really full of design. This isn't, you know, it's not for fun. It's not for a competition that ends and we're done. We are trying to do something very real, very serious, and have an impact on the world right now. One of the cars made the AHPV, Assisted Human Powered Vehicle. So maybe if, if they're part of the power source, if they need to pedal in order to move the car, in addition to having a battery pack and an electric motor, that was, that was kind of the key tenet. We also made a biofuels car, and that team was very interested in how do you run a car in vegetable oil, uh, SVO, or straight vegetable oil. It has four wheels and two passengers, and they made a steel space frame. We also made a fuel cell electric hybrid. It's, it's predominantly an electric three-wheeled electric with two passengers, and our other car is called Pulse, meaning it was supposed to be the pulse of the city, kind of a commuter concept that just has one person, and was just to show, here's what, if you were commuting by yourself, here's what your car might look like if it was all electric. <laughs> The biggest priorities of our work are to get students together and show that really passionate people can do a lot and that an issue like global warming is really not ephemeral. Even though it's in many different realms and many different markets, there are ways of kind of chipping away at it little by little. <laughs>